I'm gonna need exactly 20 seconds to explain what you're about to see. Me and Dave are crooks and committed a horrendous crime at the Pacific Standard Bank. 28 cops are trying to catch us. We have to go south and hold out anywhere on this line for 3 minutes. All minimaps are disabled and lastly, if you wanna join in on this, stick around till the very end and I'll explain how. Go! Oh, and another quick disclaimer. In future videos, our player overheads will be disabled for everyone involved. In this particular video, just me and Dave did it as a test. And one final thing. If you'd be so kind to look at your search history, grab the first thing you see and slap that into the like and or subscribe button, that'll be great. Also, if you'd be so kind to share what it was that you slapped the like button with in the comments, that would be outstanding. Let's begin this pork pizza calzone. The time is 2100, sirens are screaming and racing towards the Pacific Standard Bank. The crime? What if I told you two suspects got undressed, covered themselves in Vaseline and slid around on the coal tiled bank floor for 30 minutes straight? And so, the biggest man on Los Santos has ever seen was underway. We got into a black inferno and started rushing towards our evac point. Our plan was simple. We were just going to head as far east and towards LSIA to extract and this time we were taking things nice, easy and slow. We tried blending in with the traffic as much as we could and so far so good. Until a police helicopter showed up danger close. They decided to land on the roof for an unknown reason, which raised some suspicion. Have they seen us? Have they noticed what we were doing? And this was our moment. We put the pedal to the metal to put a little bit of distance in between us and the chopper. And now, it was time for a quick refreshment. But little did we know, the cops have heard of our small addiction. Hold up, I got an idea. There's a sprung sign here. So maybe, if you go in here, we'll find them. Hold up. Gotta check the sprung stumps. Oh, here. Okay. They were planning to set up an ambush around every sprung stop, and nearly to the second when GTA men called out their devious plan. We were about to enter a gas station for a quick sprung stop. I spotted something in the corner of my eye at that very moment. What was that? I became wait, paranoid. Wait, wait, wait. What was that? What was what? that? What was that? I don't know. I can't talk now. I'm getting a sprung. Quickly, get yours. I could have sworn I saw someone like camping outside. I didn't know what I saw, something or someone was there, something saw us entering the store, but it was getting high time to get the hell away from here. But first, a quick sprung stop. Oh, quick sprung stop. Meanwhile, on the cop side. Is there one? Uh, you gotta check the sprung stops. No doubts. There's one here. GTA man has had his first ever sprung drink. Maybe this will sway him to our side. Maybe this will make him understand what this is all about. Maybe I got a better idea. If you see if you see any sprung stops, destroy them all. Destroy all the sprung stops you see. I had a bit of pain in my heart. We haven't been spotted so far. But we were inching closer to our extraction with each and every second still undetected. But things really started heating up in this shiny black inferno. He just crushed it three times in 30 seconds. That's, that, that's average and out of one crush every 10 seconds. The drive has gone longer than 10 seconds. I know, but you've the first three, all three crushes came in the last 30 seconds. Nah, it's gonna bounce back. But then we got spotted. Things started heating up infinitely. It was time to set our differences aside and focus on the task at hand. Cops are behind this man. The helicopter fucked it. You fucked it. What do you mean we? You did. Because you're complaining, complaining, complaining. I'm just saying that people don't average out three crashes in a year. And you managed to do it three times in 30 seconds. Oh, like a bat out of hell, we got flung around by a train that seemed to appear out of thin air. Dazed and confused, sirens everywhere, the cops are here. Winter has came for House Evans and Dave. And to make things worse, Faith had put us on a collision course with our worst enemy. Uh, well, they're with us. Oh, Nick. I'm getting fucking... Run over by an NPC, are you kidding me? We dodged the bullets by an inch and we were once again on our way. Adrenaline, sugar, sprunk, rushing through our bodies. Heart rate, easy 230. Focus, dialed in at 200%. We were in the moment and we saw an escape from a barrage of police. We set the black Lamborghini straight into the dark alley. Tires screaming, echoing through the night and just like that. 
we seem to have lost the police cars. And while the Lamborghini has proven itself more than a worthy ally, it was time to swap it out for something less conspicuous. But then, suddenly, the police helicopter circling right above us, our location compromised. He must have seen us, he must have followed us, but now it was time. He hasn't dialed in our location just yet, so it was time for him to meet our AKs. A barrage of bullets we sent his way. It sent the helicopter rocking and became heavily damaged. He desperately tried to call in the rest of the police force, but he lost control of the helicopter. A fiery hot explosion, the shockwave could be felt throughout Los Santos. Which one, Paper? Well, we're not gonna find out now because he's just gonna be in Def Chat and not being able to tell us anything. Well, guys, go f go to a parking lot. They had no clue where we were, at least so we thought. One cop car heard all the commotion and it was now time to make our great escape. But you an unfortunate accident, I missed the exit. The exit was the... The big uh, hole in the wall that you just drove past. <laughs> that one that was fucking stressing out, man. Are we? You know where that cop car's parked up there? That's where the uh, exit is. Okay. You know that you know that giant hole we drove past twice now. That's where it is. <laughs> Mm, and three times the charm. We managed to get the hell out of Dodge, but time was running out. We had to be as quick as we possibly could, so we rushed towards the nearest evac, which was also the most dangerous one, LSIA. And after a short but extremely fast race, we arrived at LSIA, barely in time. Floorball, our referee and the awesome creator of this job, big shout out to him, has called in our exact location exactly at the three minute mark. Well, apparently the crooks are at the airport, so... So we have three minutes from this very moment to survive at LSIA. The tensions were running high as every cop of Los Santos police force was now on the way and knew our general location. All we had to do was hold out for three extremely long minutes. And the most tragic thing of all, we had to abandon our trusty black infernus. This was a more emotional moment than the horse moment in Red Dead Redemption 2, but farewells had to be said. We managed to make it to a remote roof of a building all the way on the west side of LSIA. Surely this must be one of the last locations they would dare to look. I mean, there are several indoor hangars, multiple indoor locations, there are a ton of places to hide here. But it was at this time the cops have caught our scent. We found the car. And now the final minute is dawning upon us. My heart is about to give out. This surely must be just as tense for the cops. I mean... I'm thirsty, I guess. They caught on to us. And ladies and gentlemen, this was going to be the most intense minute in our entire GTA Online career. I've got to sit there, hold me. <laughs> we got 42 seconds to hold. End of the runway on the left, end of the runway on the left, apparently. That, that's a... Hit. 29 seconds! There is a ladder up this side as well, so watch it. Oh! You're not taking me alive, you bastard! I'll take my own life! I'll take my own life! <laughs> <laughs> Did they catch you? Yeah, they got me out here. Oh, how close was that, man? Oh, that was so close! That was so close! Oh my god! How many seconds? Two seconds! Two seconds! After all of that! After all of that, man! Oh my god! Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this one as much as we did. If you want to participate in these recording sessions, be sure to hit my boy GTA man up with a follow on Twitch. He broadcasts whenever we record live and uh, we will do our best to get as many people in as we possibly can. Alright, with that all being said, thank you all for the sexy members. If you want to become a member and be scientifically 210% sexier, all y'all gotta do is press the join button, reap your rewards and whatnot. Come on, what are you waiting for to do it?